Okay, so Siren Beezy's gone too. She just gone. Maybe she's over here though? Nope. Alright, well, let's go see if we can find Centaur Man. If, we, if he's not there either, then they're all in another place, I guess. I'm expecting Centaur Man is here though. Because maybe we can be like, yo, they're looking for Monique, bro. You know where she's at? Or like, yo, you want to go find her so we can help her? Like, one of those kind of things. Uh, this is a different soldier, isn't it? Um, at, it is quite a pleasant little town. The drinks are good and the hotel's comfortable. That dance is really good, too. Thank you. My dancing is a passion. My passion. Stay away from Ravanchi. She's not into stalkers like you. Hmm, I feel like having fish for dinner, sliced and grilled. <laughs> well, well, you won't catch me. Stupid fish. Can you get you a drink? All right. That was an interesting conversation. That's like the most dialogue we've had out of an NPC when I talk to them. I'm working right now. I'm penniless. Why me? I'm too young for this. I'm only five years old. But in love, age is just a number. Whatever. Wahaha. But in love, age is just a number. Whatever. Wahaha. Okay, now he's repeating himself. Okay. I guess all these characters had some extra dialogue now, which I never went through. Pretty silly, but alright. Bye. Oh, now you're here. Hello. Wait, this is oh this is her. Sorry. I came to see my friend Elle, but I can't find her. Hey, there she is! The one who sank our ship! I don't think we've met Elle yet. She's a siren, alright. It must be her. Excuse me, I assure you you have the wrong person. I can't deny I'm a siren, but I've been too busy recently making lamps to leave my workshop. You say a ship was sunk. What happened here? What happened here? Hey, what are you guys doing over there? Huh? What do you mean? We found the siren who sank the ship. The siren? Didn't you hear? We found her already. Already? Does that mean I'm not getting the reward? That's right. We don't need to punish two sirens. Uh, okay. <laughs> sure. Huh. Well, that sure ruined my day. Well, okay. Bye. I guess. I like how we just stumble upon shit and it's like, are, am I even part of this? I'm just watching it. Alright. Uh, you know anything, sir? Oh, Monique, my bar 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 bar. Okay. I mean, the quest is still going. Maybe I gotta go back and talk to Monique now because I don't know what else to do. <laughs> or maybe something else is ha else is happening around town now. I don't know. We'll go find out, I guess. I won't leave until I checked everywhere again, I guess. So. I'm assuming they took the girl who was sitting there at the entrance singing. Cause she's not there. But I also wonder if Elle's the one that did this did the actual singing that caused the ship crash. Cause we haven't met Elle. Who the fuck is Elle? Oh wait, up, 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 up. hold on, hold on, hold on. There's a boink over there. Nah, no one can save her now, so I guess our work is done. So we leave her to shrivel up and die. The other sirens will hate us for this. Sirens are only good for singing songs and sinking ships. They can't hurt us if we trap them on dry land. Maybe then we'll learn not to go around sinking our ship. Maybe then they'll learn to go not to go around sinking our ships. Oh, okay, because they do it on purpose, I'm sure. Can I even go down there? I can't go down there, huh? Huh. I've always wondered if I could go down there, but I don't think so. I don't think it's an option. Oh my god, it's totally an option. I've never walked over here in my whole life. Get lost. Fuck off. What do you want? Don't bug me. Okay, well, see ya. If there's another freaking screen on the, that's in this place that I'd missed this whole time, I'd be salty. 
Alright, it doesn't look like I can go anywhere else here, though. I'd be super pissed if there was another screen that I missed here. Alright, so... They took a siren. They're gonna kill her or whatever. Now what? Hello. I feel like I shouldn't leave here until we've gone back and forth multiple times and nothing's happened. And I feel like I gotta check every room over and over again. Just in case somebody's different, you know? Oops. And again, I'm still I'm still telling me telling you I'm gonna go back to talk to Matilda. If I run out of things to do, to check. Alright, anything here? I am going to talk to the centaur guy one more time to make sure. Oh, Monique, my heart breaks, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, that okay then. But okay then. Alright, well. It's interesting that they're like, there's a boink here. I wonder what that means. I know what a boink is, obviously, in this game, but like, what does that matter? Anyway, back to Lumina. And I guess worst case, if I don't know what to do, maybe I can talk to the fortune teller again and she might give me a clue for this one. But right now, let's keep it going. Keep on trying. Going straight for lamp. Straight for the lamp, lady. Hopefully she's home now. She's not even home, bro. Son of a bitch. Well, that makes me sad, because now I'm not sure what to do. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Like part of me wants to double check everywhere real quick, make sure the soldiers aren't wandering around this area anymore. Nobody is. Other than that one leaf guy, which we don't care about those guys. They're just weird and they say random shit. I was mostly just double checking that bun man didn't show up all of a sudden, but he did not. He did not. Okie day. So. Hmm. I'm gonna go to Geo. Why? I don't know. It's the other town I haven't been back to today, really. That's my only reasoning. Just to see if anything new happened here. And then I'm going to go back to Domina after that, so that's my plan. Just going to take a look around for people that are in different places, basically. No school today. That's fine with me. Check the building, the main big old palace of arts up here real quick. See if anybody's in a different place. Oh, something's happening. Madam, you should be in bed. The medicine will be here any minute. Please get some rest. This is no time to sit and rest, Sotheby. I gotta scrape some cash together or else I'll lose the palace. But, madam, we can raise the 10 billion wooker by showing madam's art. And if we explain our predicament, he might want us grant some, us, us some relief. Don't be so naive. He's not that soft. He's a monster. A monster with rabbit ears. Oh my god, it's Nicolo. Of course it is. Hilarious. Alright, well at least we found nothing to do. Madam Christie has fallen ill. We ordered some medicine from a traveling merchant, but he had charged us 10 billion wuka. We didn't have much cash on hand, but we had no other choice. Okay. Where is he exactly? Is he here? Welcome to Cur Christie and Company. I apologize for my fatigue. Please direct all inquiries to Sotheby. Okay, what happened to Bun Man? Is he here just like perusing your fucking warehouse? Like, what the hell? Where's this douchebag? 
So I don't find him, I don't know what I'm supposed to actually do. There's the battle arena, if we want to do that, with its dope-ass fight music. I'm good, Onion-san, but thank you for offering. Bye. All right. So, I guess we'll just go. Maybe one of these guys can do something? If we complain, we could get set on fire. We gotta watch our mouths or else. Okay. We're gonna get set on fire, huh? 10 billion lucre! 10 billion! She cuts our wages and pays Nicola 10 billion? Yeah, she didn't pay shit yet. Nicolo's probably here somewhere, then. This sounds like Nicolo's last quest, by the way. Where the hell is he, though? I haven't seen him here. He might be here somewhere. I gotta look around for a bit. Alright, nobody new in there. Nobody new here. <laughs> oh, sorry. Jesus. Here? Nobody new here. Anything new from you? What can I do for you? See ya. I wonder if I have to pass the day for the Nicolo thing to make progress. I really don't know what to do with the whole Nicolo thing. Like, I haven't seen him. We just triggered a, que a new quest with him. Like, what the heck? Talk to these teachers real quick. I am Nunuzak. I say the same thing forever, even when my student is gone and dead. Can't do an experiment with Nunuzak. All right, so I unlocked a new quest with the Bun Man thing. Well, I mean, all the more reason to go check the fortune teller and see if they help me figure out the next thing on that as well. I mean, passing time here has been a pretty big staple of this whole place, so that might be what I need to do. I don't know. I didn't find Bun Man anywhere. But it's no matter for now. I want to head back to Domina and double check the uh, fortune teller. See what she says now. I got a couple of open quests now, at least. That's always a positive, right? Hope we can actually figure one of these motherfuckers out. God damn it. Alright, fortune teller. What you got? Spin to win, baby. Spin to win. I'm gonna do more than one probably just to see, but yeah. Give me something useful. A new encounter awaits at Polpota Harbor? What? Really? I just was there! You want me to go back there again? That seems pretty f silly. Sure. Maybe Nicola is there. Nicolo is there. Or maybe something with the siren thing's gonna happen now. That seems pretty silly. Wow, some of them are just that straightforward. Like, yeah, go there. It says, a new encounter. That. Wow. Wow. Just. Don't, I'm not going to tell you anything else until you go do that. That's the first time she's done that to me. Every time I've done more than one, she always tells me something stupid the second time if it's nothing useful. Well then. It's like, go to Popold Harbor, goddammit. I told you already. Just go. Okay, okay, I'll go. Good lord. Fine. Fine. If you insist, I'll go. Fine. 
I don't know where this new encounter is going to happen. I went around the whole town once. Maybe I had to leave to trigger it. I don't know. But let's look around and find out. New encounter, you say? I don't know where this new encounter is supposed to take place, but I'll take your word for it, video game. Hello. Start with this side. Alright, well the soldiers are gone and Bun Man's here! Son of bitch. The sea. The blue sea. Why, you're the one I traveled with before. Oh, but I can't remember. What's wrong with me? I can remember my name, but nothing else. I woke up lying on this beach. For some reason, I was holding a Yambaloribin. Yambaloribin. Yambaloribin leaf. I don't know. The ocean calls, but where should I go? Really? That's all you have to say? What the fuck? Okay. Bye, Bun Man. So is he just wandering here right now? The ocean calls, but where should I go? Maybe he'll be at the ship now because he wants to go out on the ocean? I don't even know, man. I wonder if that's the new encounter that the BZ talked about. I'm going to go ahead and look around again and see. What other new encounter would you possibly mean? It better not be that because that wasn't very useful. Nothing. Inspector Boyd's on patrol. We look forward to serving you. Okay. I was trying to remember what that guy did. He just talks about the hotel. Oh, uh, 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 uh. New encounter awaits you at the Polpota Harbor. So, you're telling me Bun Man was my new encounter. Okay, I'm not mad at that. That's fine. It's all well and good. But he says he wants to go on the ocean or whatever. Only the ocean can set me free or set me the right path or whatever he said. I don't even remember what he fucking said now. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and go to the boat, I guess. To the pirate ship and see if that's the answer to that. And if not, uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do after that. Let's see if he's here. Oh, Bun Man. You wouldn't happen to be wandering around on this pirate ship, would you? I don't care about nothing no mo. You hear that? SS Buccaneers are pad. Yeah, it's the same shit you always say, sir. One from a real dandy. Gotta stop saying your stupid jokes. Arr. I'm Captain Tusk. Yes, the ship's a beaut. I'm gonna look around for a minute. I didn't. I don't immediately see, see Bun Man. I figured he'd be talking to the captain or the guy steering the ship. He's doing neither right now. Okay. <sighs> Do I bother with this fucking ship right now? Like, if he's not here, obviously. Do I go down and check every place? <sighs> so I guess I could. Let me check the other deck on the other side first. Just to confirm, he's not on either side. He's not wandering on those screens. We'll check underneath to make sure. Real quick. Just do a quick pass. Quick pass. I can go in this door. Hold up. I just can't imagine him actually being here if he's not, like, immediately here. 
but I might be going to talk to fucking um the fortune teller again. Fuck. I'm trying to think of things I can go check now. Like I don't know what to do about the siren quest. I don't know what to do about this quest that I'm on right now. Oh, there's a monster egg down here. I already got this one. I'm good. I got that one ready. I don't know why I'm checking, dude. This seems like such a pointless endeavor to be checking all these rooms. I'm going to laugh when something happens when I go in one of these rooms, though. Even if it has nothing to do with any of these quests that I'm working on currently. If it's some other quest, I'm going to be like, well, shit. Something else happens on the damn pirate ship. The vague adventure continues indeed. What's up, Garzonas? How you doing today, man? Welcome in. The vague adventure of what the fuck am I doing? It's the best game ever made. So the Nicolo Calls a Quits quest has nothing to do with Nicolo then? I actually don't know. I talked to Nicolo. All he said was he washed up on the shore and he can't remember who he is other than his name. And he had some kind of leaf on him. So maybe I need to go talk to the lady back in Geo again about where he was at. Oh shit, I need to talk to the captain to get out of here. My bad. I was thinking I could just leave. I keep forgetting the captain's the only way to leave. Which is stupid, but whatever. Anyway, you're doing good, Garzonis. How am I doing? I'm doing pretty good. Just, uh, you know, enjoying this game for what it is. And, uh, you know, happy that it's Friday. Friday for the win. Nah, your ship sucks. Let me out of here. Alright. So, first things first, I'm going to go back to Geo. I'm gonna go talk to the lady. Maybe she'll say. Maybe something else will happen. Like, yo, we found Nicolo, and he doesn't remember who he is. Wasn't today supposed to be a new playthrough, though? It was, but yesterday I wasn't able to stream, so I wanted to play. I did want to play this a couple times. I wanted to get two sessions of this in this week, so because I wasn't able to stream yesterday, I spent the time. I said, fuck it, we'll just play this some more today. I don't need to start my new playthrough. It was just part of the schedule. And, you know, that was just part of the schedule. But because the schedule got pushed back a day, well, I want to play more of this still. Next week, hopefully. Welcome to Christian Company. <laughs> so, okay, they don't say anything new. The bunny man didn't say anything new. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, you wasted the whole day away playing Power Wash Simulator, Garzonas? Oh no. I know the feeling, though. <laughs> it's funny It's funny you say that. Yesterday, because I couldn't stream, I did record like one episode more of Power Wash. Just because I had time to record, but not necessarily stream. I had to Stay stay frosty, if you will. Anyway, I'm going to go back to Domina. I'm just going to see what the hell. You know what? Before I go to Domina, I'm going to go to the Underworld again. I know I keep checking, but I did talk to that one Wisdom guy. Maybe I can go here and something will be different now. Oh, you're saying I spent the whole day playing Power Wash. Oh, no, no, no. I played for like two hours. I didn't play all day. But I did play yesterday, yes. I thought you were saying you played it. Well then. You're accusing me of playing it all day, which is not true. I played it for a couple hours in the morning because I couldn't stream. But yes. Anywho, I played it, yes. No denying that. There is the truth. Oh, you found a new crack there, Garzonis? Yeah, exactly. Alright. 
Well, let's see if this fucker gives me anything new this time. Or is he gonna just tell me, new encounter with your proposal? I'm like, fuck you, I already went and found it. The bunny man, and he didn't say shit other than he wanted to go out into the ocean or whatever. Really, I'm running out of ideas, guys. I'm gonna have to start checking out random locations for quests now. If you dislocate your jawbone, try to stay calm. I've already had that fortune. Fuck you. Which means she has nothing useful to help me with right now. DJ is here. But right now I don't want any clues at the moment. Mostly because when it's when it's at the point where I don't have... Well, I do have quests open. I, just, I don't have any quests open, but I have like two open now, right? I have the Siren one and I have this Nicola one. I'm just trying to think of where I should go. One place I've been thinking about going back to check is the tower. Because that was the big moment, place where we dealt with Pearl for the first time, really. And I'm curious if Elazul went here. Well, as soon as I said it, there he is. At least we found something to do. I'm fine. Pearl must be in that room. Will you come with me? Sure. See ya. Let's go. All right, again, another place I'm going to keep. Two pearls. Oh, no. Not the two pearls. I'm going to keep the encounters off because fuck this place. This place has a lot of encounters and it's a big-ass place. So fuck that. Don't want to do all that again. <sighs> yeah, I didn't even know that game existed until you saw me playing yesterday. You looked at the game and it just made me feel weird. What, the Power Wash one guards on us? I mean, it's very cathartic. You're just chilling, cleaning shit. It's very peaceful. Very chill. Until the last like little bit of the level where you're like... My god, where did I miss some dirt? Where did I miss some dirt? Then it becomes a little more stressful. Anyway, DJ says he's been playing a lot of Pokemon Pinball. Played a lot as a kid and lost the save trying to fill the Pokedex there. There's a Pokedex in Pokemon Pinball? Oh my god. You just needed a game you could pull up on your phone and play for five minutes? Ah, that's fair. Fair enough, sir. Never played Pokemon Pinball, actually. I'm sure it's fun. Pinball games are usually fun. It's just they're pinball games, you know. Playing for a little bit at a time is kind of uh, mandatory, or unless you're going to just be a pinball fucking addict. But yeah, you catch Pokemon, evolve them, hatch eggs, fight legendaries, travel different areas, get money, buy things at the mart. Wow, it's just a straight-up real Pokemon game, huh? Good lord. It's like the Pokemon trading card game. Like for Game Boy. There's a lot to that game too. Oh, we're still going up. I thought that was a big door. Isn't this place like 11 floors? I'm not even close to done. To the top yet. Ignoring all battles because fuck it. Wait, what? I never got this? Well, oops. I never went through here without battles though. So I just got annoyed the whole time. You really care about pinball, but it has some sense of completion, and you're down for it. Well, yeah, pinball pinball in general is usually a high score type of game, so it would make sense that, for the most part, if you're a completionist type person, pinball is not for you. Pinball, one of these pinball, one of these mini mini pinball video games that exists probably would probably be fun to do for like. Some one-off shit. Not just Pokemon pinball, but like, just some random pinball game. I'm trying to think if I even have any pinball games that I could do that with. That I already own, or have at my disposal. I don't think so. <laughs> What's the most lore-heavy pinball game? I don't know, actually. I don't have an answer to that question. Anyway, we're gonna fall off this fucking path. I don't really remember how to get through this place to get higher up now. Like, I remember falling down and then getting up higher, but I don't remember how I did all that. 
Like, I'm sure there's a teleport that I'm missing that'll take me higher. Or a staircase that's, like, maybe along the back side instead of the front side. I don't really know. Huh. This is right where I just was, so... Hmm. I'm missing something. Up next, you're interested in a Metroid Prime Pinball. That might be the answer. You never played it, though? Well, I guess let me know. I have heard, I've heard of that one, too. Oh, okay, here we go. This feels correct. Here we go. This feels correct. Oh yeah, floor eight. Here we come. God. Climbing this tower is a pain in the ass. Thank God for no encounters. Holy shit, man! Nobody wants to watch me go through this whole fucking place again. Jesus. We're almost there, I think. Wait, what? Uh, you know what? I might have... Maybe I missed the wrong turn on the previous floor. Because there was another path to go down to the other side. Let's see. There's a door here. Huh. Well, let's see if it teleports me to a floor I want to be on. Tenth floor, yeah, okay. We're here. We are here. The door of fate. That's the room I wanted to be at. All right, let's encounter whatever we're about to encounter. Wait, I heard the door of fate opens only for one who knows the person inside. Pearl's inside, let me open it. What, I don't know her? Huh? <laughs> Resist me, will you? My memories are not enough to open the door, Pearl. Can I open it? I can open it, haha. <laughs> That's hilarious. I was able to open it, but he wasn't. That's funny. That night, she's... Pearl. Oh, Pearl. Your goal is to reach the Stratum of Clarius. Yes. Pearl. You will become the Clarius. Yes. You will succeed Florina. And give your life to the Jumi. Yes. Pearl. You will shed your life as tears and give them to everyone. You will continue giving your life until there is no more left to give. No. Listen to me. It is the best way. The Mana Sword will be reclaimed, and with it, the power of the Mana Stones. You must persevere until then. No. I don't want to die. You must. No. Stop this. Elazul. Jumi of Lapis Lazuli, you need not interfere. Pearl's my partner. Stay your hand or you will die. I am sworn to protect her. I will never back off. Please help Elazul. Help him, of course. Then you will both die. So be it. I do not wish you to file this place. Come, let us fight below. <laughs> okay, very well. Let's take this outside. You wait here. Do not worry. Your destiny cannot be changed. Pearl, it's alright. I'll come back for you. Please do. Okay. Wait a minute. This sounds like the main storyline material rather than just another side quest. I know, right? It sounds like I found a story thing. It's crazy. Please take care. Prepare yourself and go. I will be right down. Okay. Yeah, we trust her by leaving the room. What? Oh, cool. Pearl just straight up disappeared. Alright, well, we're fighting. 
Playing the feud. Get her. Stab that bitch. Damn, she about to get fucking wrecked. That amount of damage I just did. This spear is savage on the damage department for me. Like, holy crap. Wow, you really tried to get me with that. You were facing the wrong way, bitch. Sucks to be you. Please, he's getting wrecked, dude. Like, this is the kind of fight you would expect to be actually difficult. Fighting someone who's, like, like you. But nah, dude. She's getting absolutely shrecked. Night-night. I win. Too easy. Shouldn't even drop any lucre or nothing. Or experience points or nothing. Most impressive Lapis Knight. Promise me you'll leave Pearl alone. I will leave her alone. For a while. Uh, sure? I don't wish to fight you again. Pearl is mine. She will come back to me. Face it. He who cries for a Jumi shall turn to stone. That old saying is true, Funky G. Stay away. Farewell. Oh, there's the real Pearl. Okay, I was about to say, she disappeared on us earlier. Pearl. El Azul. Let's go. All right. Thank you. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, bye. Two pearls, the end. Questo completo. Just like that. I just had a feeling that the El Azul thing was going to bring me back here. I don't know why I didn't check there earlier, especially after the Underworld lead kind of became a dead end immediately. So, cool. Another quest found and completed. That's good stuff. And that one was very much story related. So I'm kind of glad we found that one. A faux show. Right now I feel like I'm on this wild goose chase of side quests that aren't really important. But I want to do them anyways. But when I find one of those, I'm like, yes. Yes, please. Anyway, let's tell my dang cactus about the dang adventure we just had. Room of Fate? Indeed. Room of Fate. Go write it down in your little ding dang diary, boy. Alright, Room of Fate, Room of Fate. Room of Fate, Room of Fate. Room of Fate, Room of Fate. Wow, where the fuck was it? Hello? Uh, did I miss it? Two pearls. Pearl disappeared and then Elizul found her. But Black Pearl was there too and wouldn't give Pearl back to Elizul. We need more love in this world. Indeed. More love indeed. This world's not full of enough love. We need more love. Love me. More love, please. More love would be more lovely. I want to go check on my uh, my little red friend here. Hey, friend. What level are you now, huh? Pet it. Without any particular personality. She's got dead eyes. All right, let me look at... Uh, take a pet. She's level six now, which is pretty cool. Closer to level 10 would probably be more behoove me a little more of something that I'll be like, yeah, we're going to use her now. Uh, besides fruits, I don't think I have anything else I would do here. I think I got all the workshops now, according to the, you know, based on how this place looks, I think I got all the workshops. There's no more, there's no more room for another staircase here. So I think I found all the workshops I'm going to get at my town or my home. So, yeah, I'm good. I guess back to trying to guess another place to go check. I'm trying to think of where else I should go check. What would be another place to return to to try to make some progress on something? Hmm. 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 
I don't know. I'm kind of running out of like a, a possibility in my head, like where I should go check next. Cause like the bunny didn't say anything useful. I don't know what the next step of the siren one is either. Those are both in my quest list still, right? Like those didn't like finish without me saying that I finished them. Kind of like that treasure map one never said it got completed, but yet it's still open. Yeah, a siren punished for her actions. That's all it says. And then Nicola calls a quick. Kirsty makes the ultimate deal. That's all it says. Not a couple of helpful things, I tell you what. Time to try the fortune teller. I mean, I might actually go back to her again and see, but last time I talked to her it was exactly in my same predicament I'm in right now. And she said, you know, stay still if your jawbone breaks. Like, what the fuck? Pokemon Pinball even has a basketball mini mini game where you shove shields. That's hilarious. Yeah, the ocean calls, but where should I go? That's not helpful. The ocean calls, but where should I go? Like, seriously. I'm not going to bother walking around here again. I already did a lap. Nothing changed here. Nothing. I didn't do anything different. I'm just trying to think where else I could go that may have something going on. Even if it has nothing to do with what we're already looking at. The ocean calls, but Funky doesn't hear. There is no ocean place, though. The closest thing I have is the, the ship. But the ship doesn't, like, necessarily go to the ocean. You just go to the ship. Do the McKiv Caverns count as the ocean? Because it was like an ocean cave. I am at the point where I should just start revisiting everywhere and just see if anything happens. Um, you know what? No, I'm not doing this place again. Basically, my plan is to go to each place and just check the entrance and see if anything happens. Yeah, yeah, I did sail a ship, but, like, I don't really have any heading for that, and I don't want to go through the freaking grid of the ship again if I don't have to. Like, screw that. But if I run out of ideas... Right now, I'm just trying to think of where to revisit. I could literally just start clicking on every place and just see if anybody's there. Yeah, I'm going to leave all these veggies and fruits alone. I really don't care to pick anymore. I don't want to do any more picking. I'm kind of over it. Unless there's some quest or reward for keep keeping that situation going and going and going. I'm not going to do any more growing stuff. Isn't there another location that involves the ocean? True, there is a beach. And I was there earlier. But I didn't... I don't know. I could check there again, I guess. That is an, that is an idea. I could check there again. I checked there earlier for the stupid dog and he ended up being at the harbor. Anyway, I'm just going to come here real quick and check a couple spots. I'm not going all the way through this place because fuck that. I mostly just wanted to check the like, temple or whatever, wherever the hell that is. I want to say the temple is there. Yeah, here it is. Anything at this temple? Oh, oh, I think the screen just froze for a second. Huh. I wonder if this place is going to be important later and you like got to bring a bunch of NPC specific per people here. But yeah, we can check the beach next just to kind of rule it out as that has to do with the ocean. So that is true. I, you know, that's not a bad idea. We could go there. I'm not going to go wandering through the whole thing again, though. Screw that. I will check important spots, meaning when I get in there. And if nothing happens when I get in there, I'm leaving. I'm not doing a thorough check on every place right now. I'm going to... I'm doing the surface check, where I just go into a place and check to see if anybody's at the entrance to, like, trigger a new thing. Like crafts, so many crafts. 
Oops. I mean, I guess I could check this way. This, this way didn't really have anything going on other than these chocobos. This way is a quick check. Not a lot of paths over here. Oh my god. Oh my god, I might have found the siren thing. Motherfucker. Well, good call and coming here. Not for the right reasons, but I'm here. Well, this is a surprise. So you're the siren the soldiers caught. Yes, but I was the one who sank the ship. No, all you did was sing a song. Sailors say our voices bring misfortune, but they're just making excuses. But if I don't sing, no ships will sink. They say I can sing here since it's away from the sailing routes. That's enough. You sound like one of those soldiers. Let's... Sh let the ship sink. You have every right to live freely. Then I can choose to stay in here if I like, can't I? I mean, you're always cooped up in that atelier of yours. There are soldiers everywhere, but here it's peaceful. Listen to me, El. I didn't say freedom was out here in the world. Freedom is inside your heart, and right now you're shutting yourself off from that. All we do is sing, and those stupid ships sink. Well, I don't care. We're just doing what we were born to do. No one has the right to stop us. I know, but the soldiers are constantly on our backs. We live in fear. Is freedom really worth the trouble? Worth our lives? I was born to be myself. That's freedom. Cool. Oh, also other siren bitches here too. Okay. Cool. Got an angry eye. That's cool. What's up, girl? I won't let her out. It's too dangerous with all the soldiers about. I could never put a friend in such danger. Flamish, please! She can protect L. But for how long? There's nothing but danger at every turn in this world. Flamishi, please listen to me. She mastered the Dudbear language and sold my lamps for me. So what? You're so stubborn. Don't get too much sun or you might dry out. Wow. Step away from the door. L staying in there. Jeez, why does it have to be so bright out here? Huh. Why does it have to be so bright out here? Is that a clue of what I'm supposed to do? Why does it have to be so bright out here? Like, what the fuck? I feel like that's a clue for what I'm supposed to do. I didn't mean, I didn't realize it was gonna re-trigger the entire dialogue thing, hold on. You might dry out. Well, I somehow accidentally figured that out, even though I was here looking for something with Nicolo, and I only went over there because I knew it was a quick check. I didn't go over there with any other intentions. I just figured if they're cold away here at the beginning beach, then I'm out. And I still feel the same way about Nicolo specifically. Oh, I can shortcut my way over there. That's nice. That guy will take me to the, right to the right to the right to the part with that bitch. But the question really remains: What am I supposed to do about the bitch drying out? Do I have to make it like a hotter day? Maybe, maybe the. Maybe the day matters. Like, what day is it right now? I don't even know. Maybe I have to make it Salamander Day. That's the hot day, right? It's right now. It's Witch Day. <clears throat> it's Undini Day. Now it's Salamander Day, which means... Cool. Aura. Gnome. Jin. Dryad. Undini, and now it's gonna be Salamander again. Okay, I fucked up. Aura. Gnome. Jin. Dryad. Damn it. 
I need to fucking ah uh, Undini Salamander. I need I want it to be Salamander when I go there, damn it. Ara Gnome Jin Dryad Salamander. <clears throat> Gnome. I keep counting wrong. Oh, you just have to enter and then leave to pass days? Really? Okay. Okay, well, in that case. <clears throat> I'll just make this Undini day. I'll go in and then I'll leave and then I'll make a Dryad. I, I mean, uh, not Dryad. Actually, Dryad might work too if it's the driest day. But I think that's just a tree thing. But yeah, I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come back in here on Salamander Day. I'm just trying to see if it works. This is just a complete hunch of mine. I have no idea. I got nothing. I got nothing. What else would matter for the sun being out? Like, I just figure I pick the fucking fire elemental and hope it's the hottest day. That's my only hunch. I got nothing else. And if this doesn't work, I guess we're going gallivanting around for some way to dry this bitch out. I don't really know. Won't let her out. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, my God. Blah, blah, blah. Step away from the door. I was staying in there. Why does it have to be so bright out here? I got nothing. I got nothing. Anyway, GG on catching a Rayquaza in your Pokemon Pinball. One of the high, hardest milestones of Pokemon Pinball, apparently. So GG on that, uh, DJ. Uh, I guess I'm gonna go talk to the, the fortune teller again? Like, I don't know. I guess I really wasn't done going and visiting all the places yet. I should just stick to that for a little bit. Until we get a quest, though, completo. We're not done. Where else haven't we gone yet? There's the desert, jungle. I haven't gone back to the underworld again, but I don't expect anything to happen there yet. I haven't triggered anything new to, to make me think I should go back there again. Desert? Pinball game sucks. No one will convince me otherwise. Wow. I mean, have you played Pokemon Pinball though, X-Gamer? That was kind of the point. DJ doesn't like him that much either. It's just about he likes Pokemon Pinball specifically. Unless you just don't like the gameplay of Pinball. I guess the junkyard is possible, but I fucking have been to the junkyard too much. I've been through the junkyard for multiple hours, and it was... I'm already over it. And, like, now that... I mean, now that I can, like, skip through it quickly, it's fine. But it's like, I don't... If nothing happens when I walk in, I'm not coming back to a place that has no implications for any story stuff. All right, we'll try the highway. That's the early... It's part of the game we haven't been back to. You've watched pinball games of all kind? Well then, fine. Don't play any of them then, sir. I don't want to go back through here. I don't even want to go try and talk to Gaia. Like, fuck that. <sighs> Where else can I go? Well, jungle's next. Ooh, it's a jungle out there. So these fairies are still wandering around here, right? All you humans do is fight each other. It'd be so easy being a human. Ugh. Exists in the same place as this world. The only difference is the pulsations of the two worlds. Okay. All it costs is your love. I want to go to the forested ruins and talk to 
I want to talk to the, the guy here again <clears throat> real quick, even though I got to fucking leave after I do this, but SGAD's still here, but that he's probably just a party member here, though. I'm Selkie. Nice to meet you. Yeah, that's fine. My name's Rowan. That's cool. Let's explore together a while. Sure. That's fine. Let's walk around with SGAD for a while. Maybe we can trigger something. My force, you may take something using. Yeah, okay. Because, like with Elazul, we had to trigger something with him. Maybe we can trigger something by having SGAD with us. I didn't realize he was going to be back here again. Because he was here before, and I picked him up as a party member for a minute. And then I just kind of dipped out on his ass. But, like, I, t I went back home, and he basically dipped. And I was like, oh, I didn't mean to leave him. Oops. Also, I don't remember how to get the fuck out of here, by the way. Oh, look. I figured it out already. Never mind. Dope. Okay. I'm going to take him all over the place, I guess. I really don't even know. Because I had Elazul, and I took him with me, and I went to Geo, and something happened. So maybe if I take him to, like, Gato, something will happen. That is the last time we had SCAD show up in this for a, a quest. Was in was in Gato. Oh, he's leaving. I don't want to deal with this. No, I didn't know you were gonna leave, bro. Oh, what a bitch. I don't want to deal with this. What a fuck. Well then, fuck him. I don't want him. Fuck him. I'm not going back to get him again. Where else haven't I gone into real quick just to check? Snow place. Escat is a dick. He's just like, I'm not dealing with this. Bye. Like what? You got too many bad memories at Gato? Probably. Little bitch. Little baby bag bitch. I guess I'll go back to the lake once, even though I was here not that long ago. Pretty much gone back in everywhere now. Like, I was already here dealing with the uh, the whole cat quest thing. I still want to go in and search the whole place of anywhere, unless, like, I absolutely have run out of things to check.